Hello, welcome to Ludic Science. Today I will show you how to make this circuit to make an electric fence. It works at 12 volts and has an output of around 8000 volts with a current that is not little but enough to get rid of unwanted visitors. Here you can see the diagram. The high voltage is produced by an ignition coil from a car. The primary of the coil, the positive terminal goes to our positive rail and the negative goes to a MOSFET that acts as a switch. We also have a 555 timer which produces pulses of current that are fed to the gate of the MOSFET. When the pulse occurs, the MOSFET conducts and the circuit of the primary is closed and then we have a pulse of high voltage, approximately 8000 volts in the secondary of the ignition coil. With the components as shown, we have a pulse approximately every second. This is the ignition coil. The two screws correspond to the primary of the coil and they are marked with positive and negative. This other wire that normally goes to the spark plug of the car is where we obtain the high voltage. Let's now see how the circuit works. The firing frequency of the coil is controlled by the 1 microfarad capacitor. More capacitance means less frequency and vice versa. I am going now to change the capacitor for one of less value and we will get a higher frequency of firing. How do we make the connection to the fence? Ok, the high voltage terminal goes directly to the fence which of course must be made of metal, it must be a conductor and the negative terminal of the coil goes to a wire that is on the ground close to the fence. It is something like this. The high voltage terminal of the ignition coil is connected to the wire of the fence and the negative terminal of the primary of the coil goes to a wire that is buried on the ground, close to your fence. That's all for today. I hope you find the circuit useful. Thanks for your visit and please also visit my Patreon page if you want to help me and see you in the next video.